Okay, Charlie, this is just a quick down and dirty experiment. I threw this thing together in about two hours. A little bit of fooling around in between there, but um, this is the fuel we're gonna be trying out to start. This is just some sticks I picked up fresh off the ground. Probably fairly dry material, but um, we're gonna give this thing a shot. This is the air horn setup that I told you about, which is basically um, pretty much functions under Brunelli's principle or the Ventura effect, something of that nature. And um, this allows us to add fuel to the system continually without fire breathing out the fuel intake. This is the discharge. It does have a vortex catcher in this middle there. That pipe runs to about the middle of the we're about to the middle where the diet where the vortex is going to be just where the outer circumference of most of the rotation is Okay, Charlie, for the most part, this experiment was just to show the air horn concept that fuel can be introduced into a combustion system without discharge gases coming into the fuel source, igniting them or anything like that, causing big problems. Um, didn't have a good fuel source tonight. A lot of things went wrong. My FLIR-1 camera's battery is dead, so my grand plans of getting some thermal imaging of this device failed. However, the discharge gas with a very small fire exceeded the temperature limits of this oven thermometer, which is around 500 degrees, I believe. We did see at some points it hit 444 degrees, and then the device just topped out. So, not a very good thermal couple, but um, we did max it out, and I'm pretty sure 500 degrees is the limit. So the discharge gas from this extremely small burner, which could be fed, with some type of auger system um, is basically the concept that I'm proposing for your guys' process. Um, this is not the exact size of the device that I would recommend, but it's just uh, proof of concept to show that um, it is quite easy to use wood chips as a fuel source for the process you have in mind. Tomorrow I'm going to run another experiment with a better fuel source. I'm going to be a little bit more ready. It's very late at night and I just wanted to get something off the ground and running. So we'll try this again in the morning. 